So you think if they can get six, seven points out of these three home games, I, I think that's really what they need to really reinsert themselves into the playoff talk. Tonight's game is underway. Ricardo Pepe kicks off, and FC Dallas starts play, moving right to left. Free kick that came in from the left side against Seattle. Ball played into the left channel, curled in front, trying to reach it for a shot, and it's a big save by Maurer! Maurer denies that fantastic attempt for Manny Perez. Turned around over there, let a man get inside position on him, and then it's Jimmy Maurer is coming across to his left. That's a really difficult save as he has to reach back to his right. Here's a good angle of it. That's a great save from Jimmy Maurer. Diego Fernandez after being with New England since signing as a homegrown player with them in 2011. And it will be Fernandez who will take the free kick, and it's pushed back by Maurer. Really nice tackle in midfield from Quinone. He's not like that. He's not the beast guy in there who's going to beat you up, but he's such a good technical tackler. Tavari trying to play it direct here to Pepe. Ricardo Pepe. Pepe breaks free. He's going to shoot for the far post. And Brad Stuber has it. FC Dallas has their wall positioned. And it's Diego Fugundes who drives it with the right foot and it hits the crossbar. And you hear the collective gasp from everyone. It's a good free kick. It's not quite good enough. And you wonder. And Obreon for Paxton. I'm quite sure is just about. He's just faster than Paxton Pomacle. And he just wants him running in behind that back line. As we keep talking about. Mossy will lift the cross in. And it sails past Pepe. Well, Sean reaches it. Cuts it back. Holland's head into the corner. Goal of C Dallas. So as he picks up this ball on the back side right here, you know, there's a temptation, I'm sure, just to blaze it across, but he sees the late run coming in from Ryan Hollingshead. He makes the right choice, and then Hollingshead does a good job of just slotting that ball. He doesn't have to kill it there. He just got to get it through that traffic. Great job sticking that into the far post. Well, for Subok Sean, that will be his third assist. Definitely see uh, Pochettino down there. See Sebastian Dreese. And now here's Fagundes. Fagundes still going. Tackle put in by Kenny Young. And a shot attempt that is pinged away. Wow. Tafari drives it away. Tomasi nicely done. Great job there by Tomasi. And then Aposta. And this run on the right-hand side being made by Ricardo Pepe. And now Pepe is driving into Julio Cascante. He brings it over to the right side, shoots for the far post, and one hand to it by Brad Stuber. I mean, Cas Cascante does the, about the best that he can, which is just force him into a wider angle there, give his goalkeeper a better chance to do just that, to make the save. So they've gone to four in the back. Cascante and Romagna. Nick Lima will be the right back, and here is Tafari taking it away from Dominguez. He'll play it to Sobo Chun. Oh, and he rolls a perfect cross to Jesus Ferreira to slam it home! Goal, FC Dallas! It's a 2 0 lead! Makes good choices with the ball. That's Tafari getting that ball, picking it up at a good place. Sobo Chun, he's got some runners in there. Clearly, he picks out the right one. It's a really nice ball there. Turns into a pretty easy finish in the end for Jesus Ferreira. Second goal of the year. He scored last weekend against Sporting Kansas City. Oh, and what a wonderful thing it would be, Steve, to see the goal-scoring touch return for Jesus Ferreira. One more Austin attack here, but they don't need one attack. They need two. Hollingshead and Ferreira have scored the goals tonight. Here's a clearance to the other end. And in the first regular season meeting between FC Dallas and Austin FC, FC Dallas wins it.